Hmm? Wait, what? Oh. Oh. Overlord Season 2, Episode 1. Let's hop right into it. Remember, Peach One does get early and uncut reactions. Link down in the description. And while you're at it, let's aim for 1400 likes on today's video. And I'll do Episode 2 of this show as soon as tomorrow. Ooh. Talk your shit Because I usually give up beating a Rubik's Cube After like the first three seconds I'm done over it Movement was spread Wait wait what By six great gods 600 Bro I'm telling you bro My theory still stands What if these six great gods Were actual players or some shit Because Rubik's Cube that's our shit, not your shit. Also, her character design looks kind of sick. <laughs> not wrong, not wrong. Catastrophe hmm? Dragon Lord. Mm-hmm. Fine. I like the little names though. Maybe sounding tough. Whoa. Really? She's got it like that. Or is he just saying it because uh you know like oh uh, you're my buddy type shit? Of course I'm a thing that or maybe he just doesn't know the true strength of uh Sheltier, right? And stuff. That's the people from uh, season one, right? Yes, sir! <laughs> Bro, the more I look at her character design, I fuck with it. Huh? Her eyes. How strong would a child born of my son? She wants to be beat and then impregnated. What the fuck? Oh, she's weird. What the fuck? Oh, oh, a dragon? Oh, actual dragon dragon? Sa. I like, ooh, I like the scales. Also, correct me if I'm wrong. Is that Goku's voice actor? Sounds like Goku's voice actor. <laughs> and it can speak? Empty suit of armor. That's a sick looking armor. It also reminds me of the the armor of the guy that um uh, one of Ainz's friends. Remember like the one that saved him at the beginning of the game game when he first started playing the game? Kind of like that, but a little different, right? I like the little shoulders, though. Oh, so... He can transform, maybe? <laughs> I don't know why that voice is kind of giving off funny vibes. Oh. Right. Oh. Most powerful being in the oh, oh, okay, okay. Wait a minute. Hmm? Wait, what? Oh, oh. First of all. That shit is clean how he's not even holding it. He's like, ha, ah, it's kind of like Gilgamesh from Fate, and I love that. Also, when the fuck did that happen? I don't remember that shit. That is sick. Like, look at it. Ah. Once again, okay. What? Guild weapon? Wait. Or special items from Yadrisil? Isn't that our shit? Oh, wait. I am so confused. In a good way. 
Are they talking about the ring that we saw Ainz have as well? Okay. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Who is it? Oh, she gave it to Gonzalez. Oh my god. Also, so first of all, can we just talk about... So, the dragon, from what I got out of it, can transform himself into and into a human being or some shit i'm assuming and then put on that armor and actually do shit right also could be the strongest being out there in this world that's already crazy because i want to now see you know where we stand against him and shit right also he seems like he fought shelter at some point but i don't remember seeing that in uh, uh you know epi uh, episode one i said season one and shit as well as they were talking about like the aftershock of from 100 years ago i am so confused but i'm all here for it I, I of course you know this show's probably gonna give us the answer as season progresses and stuff but i'm all here for it and then we got a weird ass you know woman who's obsessed with strength and shit oh okay so they're thinking about actually taking the war to them Oh. Uh -huh. oh. The king seems like a nice good nice dude. Oh. I like the king, man. Bro, her eyes are so like in your face, like oh just uh oh, they're coming out of the screen. Okay. Ooh. We might be making connections with the king himself. Okay. Ooh. What the fuck are we fighting? Eh, what? <laughs> it's probably weak. Yup. Yup. Nah, 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 nah. Come on, man. It's a new season. Let me see. The quality's definitely improved from season one. You could tell. And you're gone. Just like that. Beautiful. Also, I noticed they didn't use CGI this time. They used actual animation. Season one, they would, they would use CGI. This looks cleaner. Oh my god. Okay. I see you. Ooh. Oh. That's the that's the ring that I was expecting when the the dragon said what happened to your ring or some shit. I was like, wait, the ring? Because also that's another thing. When, when I paused, I forgot to talk about. They seem like they have some information. They, they were talking about the guild level and stuff and shit. It's like stuff that would only be known, or at least from the way we've heard so far, right? To players, right? So like that's why I was kind of confused. I was like, how the fuck do you know about all this? Right? You're like how do you have information about all of this stuff? <laughs> oh, no. oh no no it's urgent all right but it's a... <laughs> i guarantee you it ain't nothing serious i thought she'd be in the bed with a pillow i thought she would be in the bed with a pillow gang <laughs> Oh my, or me. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I like how it forms a little heart. Oh, 
そんな推察はいい結婚どころか女性と付き合ったことすらない俺に何を言って言うんだよこういう時あいやモテる男ならおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおお素人を命じてくだされば即座にあいやもちろん様の目の前でええー、NPC はある意味子供のようなもの子供たちにフラチのことはできないよああ、oh, I feel like it would have been a different story if it wasn't for that little green effect gang I don't know このタイルは設定を書き換えたせいだと思うし That is also true これより情報のすり合わせを目的報告会を始めるぞ Data we've gathered これがエランテルでようやく手に入れた世界地図だ。おお、これが一体の人間の国の情報しかない。これ以上のものの入手は難しいようだ。了解しました。各守護者たちに渡しておきます。OK。その前に簡単な説明をしておこう。これぞ。ここがナザリック地区。OK。そしてこの近くの大きく広がる森が。ああ、This nearby forest spreads out so far。ナザリックのダミー建設は順調か。計画通りです。おお。We got automated golem armor dudes. Hey, we got mini eins. So, uh, Scotty Mate. Hi, Tokono Kumi no Hitogakita no Kana. Uno Samban de Gosaimas. Sorry for her. Okay. Vakarimasta, Bukabukajamasama. The book at me. Shokuji no Jigana, it is a Kango in Mataki Kore. Kyo no Gohana. Aura Sama no Goyo Hambanga will much hamburger. It's a dog. It's a woof woof. Oh my gosh, she's about. She's about to say it. <laughs> Damn, that looks delicious. Holy shit. Oh my god. Oh. Must be nice, man. Eating good. Having chefs. もっとブクブク茶釜様のお子ないな。おお。ブクブク茶釜様のお声が聞ける相手のは何よりも嬉しいご褒美でした。いや。もちろん最大のご視点アインス様にお仕えするのですが。そうで説明が途中だったな。シ
わかった。考えておこう。大分母守護者統括にふさわしい働き。ああ。ありがとうございます。キュートスが面会を求めていたな。おお。玉座の間にて待機しております。What is that about? I kind of like how this episode is all about information, but it's not like overbearing, right? It's still gonna take me. A little bit of time to remember everything and all the names, especially of the characters and stuff and shit. But like, I kind of like it. Hmm? Parting word. Ooh. Okay. I, I mean, yeah, from their perspective, yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I don't know if that's the case. What do I feel like she's going to say some sh- Ah, oh, I knew it. <laughs> Oh, what? Oh, damn. Are these the lizard men that we were talking about last episode? Not last, yeah, literally last episode, right? Yeah, season one finale. To turn them into undead and shit? <laughs> the tail. <laughs> I kind of like that though. Huh? That mark? What does that mark mean? Oh. So you get a mark if you leave the tribe? Okay. Huh? もっと大ぶりになったら最初に持っていくからな。楽しみにしているぞ。Oh, <laughs> What the fuck is that? Oh, do they gotta offer sacrifices? Okay, well, is there? I was hoping that maybe, maybe there'll be a little. What the fuck is up with that giant subtitle? Okay. Overall, we got a lot of information to take in this episode, right? And if I, again, if I, you know, miss anything, I, I would appreciate it if you guys can, you know, let me know in the comment section down below and stuff, right? But so far, we got introduction to new characters. That girl with the white and black hair and stuff and she who's weirdly obsessed with wanting to be beat so that way, you know, she can give birth to a stronger future generation kid, right? Who would be stronger than both the person who beats her and herself and shit, which is okay right do your thing i guess then we got a dragon and the old lady who's like they a first of all i don't know when the fuck that fight with Sheltier and that uh, dragon in the armor form and shit took place because we don't remember seeing that right or at least i don't unless i'm having the biggest brain fart of my life but i'm kind of curious about that they have information on the actual uh, yagdri seal right the the game and shit like which is like how the fuck do you know about that right like how, how does that happen i thought like you know maybe the only people that would know about that shit would be actual players so like you know do y'all know any players what's going on with that like are you perhaps a player you know maybe the old granny is a player or some shit right that we just don't know again maybe i'm just throwing out whatever i can think of right especially because you know again the granny was uh the dragon was like what happened to your ring and as soon as they mentioned ring after all that stuff in my mind i was like ring wait a minute who else has a ring 
fucking eyes when you know the ring that you need to open all the vault and this and that and shit but then it looked like a different ring so i guess you know maybe not might be not the same ring or some shit but either way again and of course the person that she gave the ring to is gonzalez as well so again you know that's also dope but again i'm i'm waiting to find out all this stuff and then they were also talking about uh you know this is this might be uh, uh what you would call a little ripple effect or whatever of stuff something that happened 100 years ago or some shit as well so like i'm really curious and then of course i've oh, i still have my theory about the the uh, the six gods or whatever they said and shit right especially because you know the uh, rubik's cube was introduced by them and shit i'm like hold on wait a minute do you think that they're actually players or they were players because i think they were around like a years hundreds of years ago and shit right as well so they might have actually died by this point but who knows at the end of the day they might still be alive and you know actual players and just might be out there in the world or somewhere like on a whole different continent or some shit right but i'm kind of curious and you know interested and in, uh, into seeing where this whole season goes and of course we got the lizard man and stuff which is what they kind of actually talked about at the end of last uh you know season and stuff about how you know we're gonna build a dead army and shit and you know, the humans would only go up to level 40 and then you know of course albedo was like hey i know you know a place we could go get these lizard men and shit and make an army out of them or some shit right and stuff so again that seems like that's progressing uh as planned but yeah overall again dope episode a lot of information but you know again if i forgot something i would appreciate it if you could let me know but i actually liked it it wasn't like overbearing it wasn't like just straight up thrown in my face to the point where i was like okay it's too much or some shit right of course again it is a lot to take in but it was uh, nicely explained right like they did the best that they could have done again uh but yeah aside from that if you haven't already check out patreon for early and reactions and i'll see you in the next one bye have a good day take care and stay safe